So for this question, we've been given this Maclaurin series, and we don't know much about it, except that it's centered about x equals zero, because it's a Maclaurin series, and because there's no x minus a to a power. So that does allow us to eliminate e. It can't be e because cosine of 2x plus 1 would be centered at negative 1 half. So it could be based on a sine, and it could be based on e to the x. Those are the two basic things. Because there's 3 e to the x, I'm going to start with the series for e to the x. Well, that's equal to 1 plus x plus x squared over 2 factorial plus x cubed over 3 factorial plus dot 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 x to the n over n factorial. But our series alternates. But if we were plugging in a negative x value, like negative x or negative x cubed, we could also get ours to alternate. So it also helps us to rule out a. Sine of x alternates, but sine of x starts at 0, not at 1. And so unless we had sine of x plus 1, we can also rule that out. So we're really just looking at b and c. And so I'm going to plug in negative x first for all of these x's. When I do, I have 1 plus negative x plus negative x squared over 2 factorial. As I look at this, negative x is not big enough. And then the next term would be negative x squared. So that'd be positive x squared over 2 factorial. It's going to alternate, but my powers aren't big enough. So now I'm going to check choice C. one plus negative x cubed and then I'd have negative x cubed squared and then I'd have plus negative x cubed to the third power over 3 factorial so now we've got 1 minus x cubed plus x to the 6th over 2 factorial. And none of this is right either, but I also haven't dealt with the x cubed times. So I'll go one more term here. This would be negative x cubed all to the fourth over four factorial, and the one right before it would be plus x to the ninth over three factorial minus, that, that, sorry, this would be a minus. This would be a plus x to the twelfth over 4 factorial, but then all of this gets multiplied by x cubed. So as I distribute this in, x cubed times 1 is x cubed. x cubed times negative x cubed is negative x to the sixth. One more distribution. Positive x to the ninth over 2 factorial plus, and you can see now we match exactly, C is our answer.